Hi everybody, it's Crystal from A Crystal Clear Life. I just wanted to come in today with a quick tip and I wanted to share with you a way to link your Google Calendar uh, to your planner that you may be creating in OneNote. Okay, uh, this link will be able to take you back and forth between your Google Calendar and whatever you may be storing in OneNote. So let's take a look at the computer really quickly and I will show you what I'm talking about. All right, here in my May dashboard, you see that I have important dates set up um, and uh, that kind of thing, but I also would like to have a link here for my uh, Google Calendar, which is where I keep all of my actions that might be forward planned. You know, if you're out and about and you have to make a doctor's appointment or uh, somebody contacts you for a meeting or something like that, and you want to record that, the easiest way for me to do it is to open up my Google Calendar and add it there. Then when I'm doing my weekly review, I will check my Google Calendar forward and backward a week or two in advance and a week or two behind to make sure that I'm capturing everything uh, that I need to put in my digital planner in OneNote. Okay. So you see up here at the top that I have a uh, link that says Google Calendar for the month of May. And on the right hand side over here, you'll see that I have my Google Calendar set up for you to see. If I click on that link, you see that it refreshes and takes me right back to the month of May. Okay, so let me show you how I created this link. It's very simple to do, all right? All I did is I went into my Google Calendar over here on the right-hand side, and I copied this link right here. Copy. And then I went back to my May dashboard, and I... Uh, right click and say link and it brings up the link text box and I typed in the text to display as Google Calendar for May and then where it says address that's where you paste the link to your Google Calendar and say OK I just created the link again. So let me move off of my May calendar over here so you can see that it brings me to the right place. I'll go back to April. Now if I click on this Google Calendar for May link, you see there that it brings up my Google Calendar for May and I have it right there. Now it's great to have it on my main dashboard page, but I also can copy this link copy and let's take it to that first week in May and maybe I want to put it at the top up here so that if I'm planning it in my first week of May and I need to jump over to my Google Calendar there it is I can go through and do that for each week so here's May 9th through the 15th come up at the top paste there's May again the next week come up to the top paste and so on and so on. To me, this is another great way just to use links in your OneNote planner to take you to other places in your planner or places outside of your OneNote planner and into uh, other things that you may have on your computer or in the world. In this case, it's my Google Calendar and it helps me uh, when I'm doing my advanced planning to find that calendar more quickly. Anyway, just wanted to share a quick tip about using links to link you to important things like your calendars. All right, well, here's hoping that you can live a more simplified and organized life through better planning. I do it through OneNote. Until next time, okay, bye.